Assalamu alaikum. How's everybody doing? Okay, this is Daniel Lucas once again. Okay, today we got something special. We all been waiting for it. Okay, Rapidos. Comic commuter cars. Oh, so good. I had to get two of them. Y'all got to excuse the mess and stuff because uh, <laughs> I wanted to do that. I was so eager to do this stag going to uh, review. So, and stuff, man, I had to do this review and stuff and, you know, do the preliminary, the testing and everything uh, to get everything prepped, make sure everything's working. Okay. Uh, so this is going to be a reservoir dog raw type deal. Okay. To do this. Okay. This review, just like a lot of you guys. Okay. I've been waiting for this for what, uh, two years and stuff. I'm sure y'all been waiting. Okay. And, uh, it was so good. I had to do, I had to get two sets. Okay. Duplicate. Okay. Don't I ain't worried about it. Cause I can go ahead and redecal one of them. Okay, I'm going to show you, you know what I'm saying, the live version. I'm going to show you the physical version, which you're going to get. We're going to do a quick unboxing. Matter of fact, I already started unboxing because, uh, you know what I'm saying, I had to do a lot of edit editing, tweaking, or whatever, and stuff, you know, with the, uh, you know, trying to get the video right. So, uh, we're going to go through it real quick. Okay, when I opened up the boxes, okay, uh, you know what you get. You get your magic wand. You got your little sticker, okay, because I'm a nerd, too. Look at my table, okay? I'm here in the, uh, excuse me, the Kingston Trolley Museum. You get your little Rapido sticker, you know what I'm saying? Your long shank couplers for those who operate on tight curves, you know what I'm saying? Your, you know, you got different spare parts, air hoses, and everything, uh, yard dampers or whatever, okay? You also got... Uh, uh, an explode an exploded parts diagram. As you can see, you know what I'm saying? Your parts number list. And of course, you also have, just like Rapido does, storyline. Okay, you got one in American and you got one in French. Okay. Uh I got all kinds of stuff all over the place. It is what it is. Again, I got two sets, one I ain't open yet. And one I got spotted everywhere. Okay, it is what it is. Okay, it's beautiful, it's nice and stuff. So, okay, in the box, okay, you got your magic wand, okay, for your lighting. Okay, you know, your foam board, your clamshell covers, okay, is one of the coaches. Okay, the Empire State. Uh, I do Metro North. Okay, I do Metro North. Uh, that's the model commuter agency that I'm doing. Uh, shoot, this ain't the only commuter agency that I'm doing. I got other, I got some fictional commuter agencies and stuff as well. However, okay, uh, shoot, you know, I got a lot of New York paraphernalia. Um, as you can see, oh Lord, I'm part of the, part of the Charlie Museum, so. <laughs> and then plus I'm doing that children's series. They ain't gonna stop. So yeah, it's gonna uh you're gonna see a lot of New York uh equipment. All right. So let's get to it. Okay, we've got here. Okay, each set comes with one cab car and two coaches and stuff. Okay. You got different community agencies in the Northeast, okay, which has the comment and the um, the you know the, the common and the uh shoreline of fleet, okay. This is the shoreline of fleet got your SM two horns. Okay, let's check the details. Okay, this is what you're gonna get. Okay, got your headlights. Okay, your ditch lights and stuff. You know what I'm saying you got your you know what I'm saying crossbars and everything. And so the details is far explicit, exquisite. You got your icicle antennas. And stuff, your stairways, your windows, and stuff for your for your uh, motorman. Okay, when the car is in push mode. Okay, uh, the trucks are you know is very exquisite. All right, and so we're gonna take a look at the um, undercarriage and stuff real quick. You're gonna be crazy and stuff, man, about the undercarriage. Uh, on the front of the uh, cab coach. Okay, you're gonna notice you got your little small. 
pilot and stuff. You got your multiple unit cables and stuff. Uh, well, your head and power cables and stuff. And typical New York fashion, okay, you just got a windshield, okay, you got your storm door, okay, so you got your air scoops that's molded on, okay, your car roster number on the side, the letters and everything, the logo and stuff is legible, or your one signs, your, your uh, emergency kick glass and stuff, you know what I'm saying, all that's all the molding on parts. And, you know what I'm saying, with the commuter car, it's pretty much basic utilitarian, okay? Same thing for your your your, your regular coaches, okay? Of course, you know what I'm saying, the blind ends on each side and stuff, the, the details are exquisite, okay? The trucks and stuff, the car is free rolling, okay? The car is free rolling, as you can see. You know what I'm saying? So if you're doing a push pull, this is necessary. Okay. Uh and stuff, you know, you got your you got your marker lights if you're going up to uh Poughkeepsie, or if you're going up to Wasake, or if you're going to uh Danbury or Waterbury or New Haven, okay, you can see that. Okay, you wave the wand. Okay, you got your headlights and your ditch lights and your marker lights come off when you're coming towards Grand Central Terminal. Okay, each daggone agency that you got, okay, that these, that uh, Rapido's made. New Jersey Transit, which does not feature the ditch lights, okay, but uh, MBTA, SEPTA, uh, Condot, Metro North, okay, and um, AMT, also uh, the community agency up in Montreal, Okay, they have their version and stuff, all a bit different and rather unique and stuff, possibly different features. Uh, another thing that you're going to notice, okay, just go ahead, go a push mode. Okay, we're going to bring you towards the lights, the lights, let me show you the lights. Okay, you can look inside the cars and stuff real quick. Okay, um, it's pretty much what you see. You know what I'm saying? Inside the uh, commuter cars. If you want to go ahead and add passengers, okay, the lighting is spectacular. Eventually, I'll change the 58 couplers so that way the car is just a little bit closer, okay, to the, um, to the, um, to the, um, engine or to each of the cars, okay? So, okay, uh, Katie couplers. Okay, you know what I'm saying? Eventually, like I said, I'm going to change the scale. You know, I do DCC. Uh, of course, you can see the lights and stuff, the seats and stuff. It looks just like what you see in a typical comic car. Okay, same thing. Okay, if you're doing a maintenance type deal, if you're shipping a car to Croton Harmon for repairs, okay, you got your marker lights. Okay, if you have a Jeep to go ahead and ship the car to Croton Harmon, or the southeast for maintenance. Okay, that's where the wands come in handy. And if you just want to go ahead and you know park the car for the day, cut the lights off. Perfect job, beautiful. Okay, kudos to Rapido. You guys are too good, too marvelous. All right, let's look under the car. Okay, it's two different deals. Okay, one thing that we all notice about Rapido. Something out there, and I'm not chastising Warthers, okay? Uh, but I got to say, Rapido always knocks it out the park with the details, okay? As you can see, this is the cab car, okay? You know, you got your sandbox or whatever, okay? You know, your detailed truck side frames or your inner bearing uh, trucks, okay? You got your three air tanks. This is a cab car, and just look at the conduits and everything up under, the, all the appliances up under the car, okay, what you see. Uh, so you can look at your head and power and your, your, your MU cables, okay, for each car and stuff. And also, just as you see the cab car, okay, look at the coach, okay. You get two coaches within a set and you get the cab car, okay. Metro North usually runs two Cab cars, maybe three, you know what I'm saying, along with a coach, seven cars, one engine and stuff. You know what I'm saying? It's the typical setup. 
Okay, when FL9s was running, okay, usually they ran the FL9s back to back or whatever. You know, that's how it was. Okay, that's how it is. Now it is, you know, you got a P42, well, excuse me, a P32 locomotive that's, you know, assumed the tasks and the job, okay, for the uh, train sets. Okay. Uh, again, they knocked it out the park with it and stuff. So, you know what I'm saying? Again, the cars are free rolling. Okay. The cars are free rolling. The lights and stuff is immaculate. Okay. Let's put this car right here on the tracks. Okay. And the stuff, uh, we're already at 10.41. Okay. 10 minutes, 41 seconds. The stuff on the draw. Okay. With this thing here. So, you know, and like I said, typical setup, you know what I'm saying, uh, for Metro North coach or Metro North train. Uh, for those out there that's going, that live way out in the suburbs, like I'm out here in Kingston. So I had to take the, uh, me and a buddy of mine, okay, formerly Amtrak and stuff, uh, brother Isaacs, we takes the train up to Poughkeepsie and then takes the bus to, uh, Kingston. Okay, so we're up here because it's so nice and stuff, and you can have nice things up here. But again, okay, typical setup, okay, of a Metro North train, okay? Sometimes you got a cab car tucked in behind a car. Sometimes you got a cab car tucked in behind a cab car. Again, and stuff, uh, what you see and what we realize and recognize, respectize in, you know what I'm saying, uh, Metro North fashion is, you know, again, sometimes the cars and stuff, man, you got a cab car, it could be a spare, you know, office for the um, conductors and stuff. You got your icicle antennas, like I said, and you know what I'm saying? So, you know, I got to cut the engine on. So, because this is how it is. You know what I'm saying? Again, I do DCC and stuff, nothing else. Again, Forgive the mess, okay, uh, it's cold as hell, <laughs> but, uh, yeah, and stuff, man, um, I pay five eighty six for two of the sets, okay, at Train World, and, uh, like I said, I'm pretty impressed with what they got going, um, like I said, yeah, the FL9s don't run no more, sadly. Okay, a lot of these model manufacturers, they still got a lot of catching up to do to try to modernize what we got going on. Because, no, I got to add the Wi-Fi antennas and stuff, you know, and, they, you know, and the cars came from out of the 80s. So, and, you know what I'm saying, if you also notice, some other cars, you know, they came out and, you know what I'm saying, with the mid door. So, I, I assume that, Eventually, you know, Metro North, you know, the, the um, uh, Rapido's more than likely going to end up doing them too. You know, Jason and all of that, you know, they actually pick up the phone, they listen. <coughs> uh, uh, Waters, that's what you're missing out there, B. So, um, yeah, like I said, man, uh, you're going to be pretty impressed. Okay, the... Uh, it's <coughs> Uh, about three hundred dollars or so, less than three hundred dollars. Okay, it's your brick and mortar shops and stuff. Uh, and like I said, I'm pretty impressed with the cars, man. Go ahead and cop them, okay? If you do commuter agencies and stuff, man. So, like I said, I'm impressed. <clears throat> Go ahead and cop, then get yours, okay? Because it's out there. If it's still there. Cause these things more than likely so crazy, okay, if you got some bread, yeah. okay. Again, one cab coach, two coaches, you know what I'm saying, line it up with your engine, okay. For those who do a small pike, if you're doing a major city, of course, you know what I'm saying, I because I do a major city, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying, like New York, so you're going to need a whole bunch of them, okay. So, <laughs> hope you got the bread for it. Hey, this is Daniel Lucas from Shutting It Down, all right? 
know what I'm saying? I'm going to go ahead and play with my trains before I catch my bus back down to Poughkeepsie and get on the real train. You know what I'm saying? Word up. Take a look at these pictures and see what they're like. Yes. In the notebook. 